You don't realize the powers you're going up against. Thinking you're talking to an internet audience, you're actually arguing elite families who silently run our public schools to create a new world order. Look it up while they private school their children. Do you really think the biggest businesses aren't in the business of controlling our children? Wake up and research Horace Mann, John Dewey, the Rockefellers, Rothschilds, the owners of Walmart, and more. The origins of public schools in the United States were brought about by the Rockefeller and Carnegie Foundations. What many construe as philanthropy is something more perverse. The Industrial Revolution created massive industries and they needed workers. The best kinds of workers were ones that did what they were told and asked few questions. Perfectly efficient for the industry, perfectly dehumanizing for the worker. If you think your education comes from your taxes, you've been duped. The free school idea isn't failing, it's working exactly as they wanted it to. It was not the invention of taxpayers, but wealthy businessmen in the 1840s and took the militia of Massachusetts to rip children from their parents who were unwilling to hand over the education of their children to racist businessmen they had never met. At that time, most Americans attended private schools or, once learning to read and write, effectively taught themselves. All these free-thinking individuals couldn't possibly be turned into dutiful automatons. The corporate giants of America needed a solution to their individualist free-thinker problem. The Prussian model was their answer. The powers of America wanted the Prussian result, unthinking workers and obedient citizens. Thus began the implementation of compulsory public schools in America. It didn't happen all at once. Some states were more reluctant than others and the overwhelming majority of public opinion was against it. With great wealth, however, comes great influence, and the tycoons of our nation got their wish. Do your research before making these videos. The public doesn't need to be reminded of how miserable their education system is. They need to be allowed to get out altogether. Hashtag abolish free education. My response two months later to... I don't need to put his name. You are making an assumption about what I've researched and what I don't realize I am up against. Thanks for watching.